Alrighty guys, you know who it is, Tiny Gamer. I'm back with another video. So today we are playing Destroy All Humans. Um made by THQ. So let's get into this. Uh one last video to go and uh the series is finished. And yeah, so keep that in mind. Hello, friends. Have you ever gazed up into the night sky and wondered at the possibility of life on other planets? What marvelous beings might exist out there, hands extended in friendship, awaiting the moment when we humans take our first tentative steps into space? What tales will be told of that glorious day when we are first contacted by our brothers from beyond the stars? Systems go, General. Four. Come on, baby, show us what you got. Three. What the hell? Two. What in the blue blazes is that? One. No, wait. Stop the countdown. Incompetent fool. I should never have sent you. What's shaking, Pox? You look a little, what's the word? Constipated. <sighs> Let's just say I hope you turn out to be less of an evolutionary dead end than your predecessor. You lost me. Shall I tell you a secret? Few of our people know this. But the DNA patterns in our cloning banks are becoming more and more degraded with each new clone. That's bad, right? Only if we want to retain our immortality through cloning. Of course it's bad! I sent Crypto-136 in search of a planet we visited many eons ago. A planet seeded with pure Furon DNA. But I lost contact. Let me get this straight. You sent me, uh, him, Crypto-136 to a hostile planet, and he's disappeared, maybe captured, maybe even being tortured as we speak. Well, I wouldn't jump to any conclusion. I bet you wouldn't. Let me tell you something, Pox. You're a smart cookie, but there's a time for thought, and there's a time for action, and this is one of those times. Which? The second one. <sighs> Perhaps you're right, 137. Of course I'm right. You kidding me? A cryptosporidium captured by a bunch of monkeys? We gotta go in. We gotta crack some craniums. We gotta rescue me. Him. He's gotta rescue me. I mean, we gotta... I gotta... Brains, man. When do I get to blow things up? Patience, Crypto. Patience. I take your point. Prepare the mothership. That's what I'm talking about. So, what's the name of this crummy planet? Our destination. The planet Earth. Alrighty. <clears throat> um, Pops, he sounds just like Invader Zim. This is, this is why I like this game so much. So let's go to our destination. Um Here we go.
Orthopox to Cryptosporidium 137. Come in, Cryptosporidium. Crypto here. How's the view from the safety of the mothership? Very funny. Let's just say I'm glad I'm up here and you're down there. Loathsome little planet. Now, Crypto, to ensure this invasion runs smoothly, it is imperative we identify the dominant life forms on this world. Those lactating bovoids are likely candidates. Surely you don't mean those foul smelling gas bags beyond the fence? Yes, I'm afraid I do. But they're covered in nipples. Now, Cryptosporidium. You may look and aim by physically manipulating the right analog stick. You can move about the area using the left analog stick. We can peer into the minds of lower... Moo? Primitive, yet profound. Scan another one. They eat with their mouths? Ugh! I think I'm going to be violently ill. Attention, Earth creature. This planet is now part of the Furon Empire. Your benevolent masters welcome you. <coughs> At this time, we wish to abduct you for the purpose of scientific research. The procedure will be protracted and invasive. Do you have any objections? <coughs> Earth creature, I am addressing you. Respond or be vaporized. I don't care how many stomachs you have. I don't have time for this. We Furons have evolved the astounding power of psychokinesis. Target an object or creature, then hold the L1 button. Keep holding, then tap the triangle button to... Martha, you didn't tell me we was having barbecue for dinner. Wait a minute, that ain't steak, that's... Holy mother of... Martha, give me the shotgun! Attention, you do in fact have weapons. Oh, Just hold the R1 button. Try it. Give that beauty farmer a taste of the old Zapomatic. So if you collect brains, uh, you can like buy things with them, but we need to collect um, some before we can leave, which a lot of brains. Evening, Ms. Turnipseed. We got a call from Farmer Dixon over the other side of the state road. Said he heard some pretty strange noises coming from over this way. What is that? A new silo? Crypto! That human law enforcement officer is attempting an unauthorized entry of your spacecraft. If those pea brains were to get their hands on your quantum deconstructor, they could rip a hole in the space-time continuum! Thank you. 
Oh, the furonity. Vaporize them, Crypto! Out of brain. Jeez, this is even worse than that time she ate them funny mushrooms. Good thing we got you? backup coming. Jeez, this is even worse than that time she ate them funny mushrooms. Good thing we got backup coming. I scrape dirt like you off of my shoes every morning. Crypto, my radar shows more humans approaching. Hurry to the saucer! left analog stick to propel the saucer forwards and backwards. And a straight left and right. To turn the saucer, use the right analog stick. industrial complex. We can't allow them to alert their leaders to our presence. Exterminate them! Now! Open fire! Did you see what I saw? You bet your sweet ass I did. What did you see? Little green man in a flying saucer wiping out the best infantry unit in the U.S. Army. Right. Good. Me too. Green? Not gray? Don't be a stiff. You know what it means? Absolutely. What? It means the papers got it right for once. Get on the horn to Silhouette. We've got the worst case scenario. The eggheads were actually onto something? I don't believe it. Believe it. Roswell was only the beginning. The invasion is on. Alrighty guys, like I said, we still have to collect brains, so we still have a lot more to do before we can go back to the mothership. 250 brains.
Alright, we're getting there, slowly but surely. Um, what can you expect here? I don't like the Xbox 360 version of this. Uh, they, they made like a third version of this game, or a fourth installment to it, and that's what killed it right there, was when it went to the Xbox. Um, so, here's the thing, like, humans coped and they finally learned, you know, realized that alien life exists, and, you know, people are not scared of you anymore, like, they just, they just know you're an alien, that's really about it. You know, you're just, just an alien. The second one and the first one are probably the best. Maybe the third one too, but you know, that's only for the Wii. <laughs> Concentrate. All right, we finally got our brains, now we can go to the mothership. Yeah, I'm going to end the video here. But I'll let you listen to Pops. Now then, I know what you're thinking. 
What can I, a lowly novice, do to help bring about the destruction of Earth and the inevitable reign of the Furon Empire? Well, I'll tell you. It was in the earliest days of the Empire we realized our species was doomed. Eons of waging war on inferior races with unregulated atomic weaponry had mutated our genes. We could not propagate due to our complete and utter lack of genitalia. Fortunately, a Furon ship happened upon Earth on its way back from destroying the Martians. Human society was young and nubile. Sailors on a foreign planet, letting off steam, one thing led to another. Long story short, every human being alive today has buried deep in his genetic code a strand of Furon DNA. Over the eons, we've learned to clone ourselves, but with each iteration, the information degrades, and the results are increasingly unpredictable. The Furon genes in humanity's DNA are ancient, uncorrupted. They represent the future of the Furon race. If only we can get at them. <laughs> Alrighty, so I'm going to end the video here. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment and before I leave. Uh, the second one was in the 60s. I think the third one was in the 70s. And the one on the Xbox 360 was in the 80s, I think. Or maybe the 90s. Uh, so. Yeah, this one's in the 50s. Um. Uh, and all that fun stuff so yeah don't forget to subscribe like comment and uh yeah i'll see you guys next